morning good evening good afternoon family depending with where you are watching me from my name is baby caro and in case you haven't subscribed kindly do so for more and more amazing video actually today is a nice day it's um it's morning not even morning it's almost lunch time it's at it's at 11 almost 12 noon and today actually it's a very nice day and um I'm, I'm, I'm thankful and I thank God for this day and today I don't know if today it will be our last day here so I think I might be traveling let's say I think maybe tomorrow yeah we'll see how our days goes so maybe today will be our last day here and um, actually today I wanted to take you around here at this place so I think uh, we'll explore Actually, you are going to visit one of the shops there on the downer side. You are going to pick there something. So I think I'll get to take you around. We'll get to explore this beautiful place here. Let's say it's kind of a, I'll be giving you a house tour. House, let's say house tour and compound tour. Yeah, she also allowed me to film, but I will just take a small portion here in the living room. I show you how it is and the kitchen area. Then also we'll get to walk around, you know, explore the beautiful compound. You see, you see the beautiful view from the downer side, how the cars, they are well packed. Actually, it's so nice. We'll get also to visit the... I don't know how it's called children usually play there on the other side yeah i think we also get to see maybe the view there the swimming pool yeah but don't worry my friends they are actually so shy so um, i'll take much of the time in talking and showing you showing you around yeah but um stacy actually also she will take us and show us around because me and um, there's a friend who also came whom we went to the mall with she's uh, her friend so she came to pay a visit here so she'll be also like we'll also be exploring around with her yeah but don't worry they are camera shy but uh, they'll be taking around so i'll take much of the time in talking yeah so i think right now we'll be starting with uh we wanted to go to a shop actually these are i don't know if it's called the estate but um the thing i was so surprised with you know it looks like um a big compound people even can sell buy goods there's just a shop on the nearby here are these uh, apartment here yeah so there's even a butchery i was so shocked for me i really thought like they have to go until outside the road but uh, most of the things like uh, they can buy they can buy inside here i also realize eggs they are being brought inside and um, you know they can also buy from the inside so we'll take a quick quick tour you see how our beautiful place is here and uh, also once again i wish to appreciate so so much stacy you know for having me exploring here the beautiful place i don't know if i could find someone like this you know Right now she's more than a friend who could take me around and everything at the big mall actually people told me it's called a, some say a hyper market some say a mall just the way like i said some say a grocery store so i don't know which is which yeah but uh, it's a very big shop where the everything they are even packed chicken i've never seen it yeah there were some packed chicken and um actually we for me i tested it yesterday for the very start, first time but uh i'm so sorry i didn't show you the cooking process and everything but uh i got to test a, a chicken packed inside from the supermarket i've never eaten actually it's the first one and uh, what i can say uh actually it doesn't take it doesn't taste like the organic chicken like the ones which you can leave them they loiter around like you know the ones which can eat everything on the ground it tastes a slight different i think the organic one it's sweeter than the ones which are packed inside the the mall yeah i think that's the only difference 
yeah but everything was so nice for me I'm just enjoying the cool place here and what i can say i'll really really miss this place so much i'll miss the lift i'll miss the you know just the cool view here the relaxation here this thing is so warm it kind of looks like a grass i think it's an artificial yeah everything here it's so 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 warm yeah so right now we'll be exploring a new 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 place so i'll give you a quick tour and you, uh, you can also drop some reviews according to this place but for me i rate it at 10 over 10 i've never seen such a beautiful place like this yeah so here we go well here we are inside the house and we have stacy here say hello <laughs> I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. Thank you. Actually, she's watching my video here at the television. She's enjoying. How was your night? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Enjoy watching the video. And we have our baby here. Baby. Baby. Say hi. so beautiful and the good thing which i love um there's some greens here I, I don't know whether it's planted or it just grew like uh, by itself but it's so nice this tree over here i don't know it somehow looks like a, a purple tree it also looks so so different yeah so there's a resting place over here so whenever you are bored, you can come here like this, have a seat with your friend, talk stories over here. And uh, there are so many, it's not only this one. There are still more also like uh, on the other sides like this. Yes, Stacy. People come here and uh, have some rest. <laughs> Actually, Mshene is a gossip, so when you have that friend who is, uh, you know, like a somehow talkative, you can come here and uh, talk all you want. Then after you're done, you go back like uh, inside to your houses and have a cool rest. Oh, but there's no iron sheet from the top, so when the sun is too hot, I think it can just reach on your head. Yeah, but I just love the way it's surrounded with, uh, you know, flowers. I don't know if this is a flower tree. It looks like a tall grass. Yeah, but I love the way it's surrounded. It also has some, some privacy. Yeah, this is how beautiful it looks like. Yeah, so we are still exploring the new environment. And actually, there are some kids. Who are playing over the other side like you can play football <laughs> see kids they are playing and uh, actually you'll find most of them they are using the bicycles yeah on the other side and it looks so clean even they are removing the shoes while going inside mm -hmm. it's a nice place yeah so actually you are going to the outside part So we 
are still working and I think these are a pit and you can see it it even has the road sign actually I realized there are so many road sign inside here because there are so many vehicles which they drive into so you can see the play field of the kids actually it's enclosed from the inside you know they can play football they can ride I saw even others they were skating yeah and uh, you know you can hear the children play you can hear the sounds until late in the night that's like uh, 11 11 p.m. at night you can just hear their sounds the way they are they are playing like this yeah so you can see and I think this is grass which is planted on the other side it has been enclosed mm -hmm. I don't know which type of grass is this it's kind of you know wet I don't know which flower is this yeah so we still go and uh, actually there's even a car wash on the other side so in case maybe they want to wash their vehicles I think they just come to the other side no that's not a car wash there's some construction going on on the other side actually the car wash is from the upper side yeah so we are heading to the swimming pool place though I'm being told like uh, today is on a Monday and being on a Monday it has been closed because they usually do some cleaning there so today it has been closed but we just go and check like how it is because I uh, actually I've never seen it yeah but then we go everywhere we went with Kemi we went to one but it was so nice so there's some car wash on the other side like right now you can see the vehicles i think maybe after wash they are being packed over here yeah so here we go so i think this is a swimming pool over this side though today it has been closed i never knew like uh, they usually close it like this so that they can do some cleaning so there's a car wash just right there behind me and uh they're trying also to do some cleaning See how beautiful they are decorated from the other side yeah but for me I love this place and the good thing I just realized like it's so clean you can't find even a white paper on the ground see how clean it is also here on the grass side you can see it's so green so clean and it's full of planted with some nice flowers but here there are so many blocks let's say when uh, you are so new I think you can get lost so maybe when you want to enter inside you usually contact uh, the one whom you are visiting so that uh, that person can call the security because it's too tight you can't just enter inside like that because even in their place you need to put the you know the fingerprint so when you are at the gate, you have to mention the one who you are going to visit so that you can mention the block and the house number. So these are the blocks. There are so many. Even right now, I don't know where we came from. But uh, so long as I'm here with her, I can't get lost. But there are so many blocks. Like this one, it has been written block 17. Mm, you can see it has been written slow down children playing which means vehicle usually pass this road so much even the road I just realized they have some arrows and this is the place where they park I think which has been enclosed in a yellow form yeah you can see some arrows there from the front this one is a dustbin you know everything here it's so clean I guess even there are usually maybe some workers who usually do the work and maybe getting paid yeah and this the wall which is enclosing them from the inside so there's a wall actually it's surrounded like all over the place like this yeah so you cannot enter inside that easily there's a tight tight security I guess even there's no cases of maybe thieves and everything because you have to access the fingerprint so without that you can't enter inside
here actually there's some zebra crossing for the i think for the it's for the pedestrian so here we go to the last part now So I never want to go to any floor. I think this is ground. When I came, I was so green, but right now. the seventh one so I've never got to visit there but I think maybe when you go there I think it's an open place like an open field like this and I just realized here at the top this one here it's like a sensor at night when you walk like this when here it's dark you'll get itself lighting up so here we go inside oh and I just realized this one when you press like this you heard that sound? Yeah. I just realized it yesterday. I never knew it. It's when I think maybe there's a visitor here. You press and it, it rings like a bell. But I've not seen it from the inside where it's located. Yeah. Mm. But this one, it's so new. Actually seeing it for the first time. Yeah. Here we go inside. Welcome back to the house, though we are not going to the inside here. Yeah, so she allowed me to take this. So I'm just going to show you like on the sitting room side and at the kitchen place. Yeah, so let's start with the... Hmm. Yeah, so there's some curtains here. Actually, they are so well. And the good thing, I'm loving the way it's blending with the white color, the white and white. I usually here i don't know which, which one is the sheer i'm not sure so for me i love because uh, she matched it the white together with the white wall here then here we come to a very big television and i can see myself on the it's like a mirror you know i'm almost the same height see <laughs> but the good thing i love it it's so wide and when you sit like in any angle even if you are sitting from there you can have a clear view of the television on this side and this one is a tv stand it has some nice drawers you know everything here i think her best color is white because this one is white you know a comfy how is it called a comfy sofa actually it's kind of when you see it you feel like you are bouncing yeah you can see everything here it's white this one is white you see the mat it's white and it's so clean there's no soil or anything like it's so clean yeah so like everything here it's white yeah like uh, you know the white is giving the the good the good how is it called a clear view it's making it to look like so beautiful and i'm not sure this one we call it is it a chandaria or it's another one for me i'm thinking 
I'm not sure but it's so nice at night when you light it you can think here it's in the morning like the view is so 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 bright yeah for me I love it and there's still more these are light also this one is a light over here yeah they're so nice and here we have a, a dispenser water dispenser actually I tried it here for for the very first time and I realized there's a hot place normal and cold so for the cold actually it's uh, giving the cold water you can think the water is from the fridge like it's so cold and the hot you find it's so hot and the normal is the one which uh, even a child can drink so normal I think a small child can drink it but cold the bigger ones can drink but if you have a hole in your mouth when you drink something cold you feel like your your teeth is moving out yeah so for the people who don't have the teeth problem the cold is so nice yeah so these are nice water dispenser and we have a nice kitchen here wow and it's so smooth i don't know if this one we call it a marble i'm not sure a marble top but it's so nice and it's so easy to clean yeah and um at least you can serve here food like a let's say even you are mending it's like a, a dining place you know you can serve a lot of meal for many people so these are a big table yeah so when when we came actually we have been feeding from this place it's so nice it's so comfortable yeah you just stand here as you eat yeah it's so nice yeah so these are let's say it's just like a dining table then we come to a beautiful kitchen where we cooked it was on this side at least right now i'm not that zero at least i've mastered but the only thing which i know to use it's only this button here you know this button at least right now they forgot to close yeah you know at least right now i can use I know only to operate this button for this place I still don't know yet but she told me this one is a, a coin like you can use it with a I don't know with electricity I've forgotten yeah but it's so nice so we use here for you know for for washing utensils there's a tap here and the water I love because it's really coming on a high pressure and you can regulate it but when i came i didn't know how to light it up but right now you know i used to light it so i just pull it like this it used to come with a, a bigger pressure i never knew you could uh, actually regulate it when you want it to come small many yeah but for me i don't love misusing water i just love using it quantity by small small you know because there are some people also there who they they like that water like when i visited trukana there at kakuma oh my god like there's no that sufficient water yeah you know at least you know let's say when someone from there comes here trust me he will minimize the water he won't like uh, use that like uh, you open the tap maybe you leave it like running yeah like you can minimize it so well i just realized our friend stacy she knows how to minimize you know she uses it so so well you can see how it's so clean like after every dish you know we keep the utensils so clean but i really loving it here because you are not using like too much energy you just stand like this and you wash like um, it's so comfortable until to have, i think i've started now forgetting to the way i usually bend and you wash them on the ground but i think i might travel so i think i'll miss this place so so i'll miss it but one day i'll come again to visit then we come here at the kitchen i don't know it's called the kitchen rack what is the name it holds the utensils and the good thing i love it 
you know us there in the village we usually use that getangura the one which is usually on our outside it's uh, with the wire mesh then when you wash it we put it the utensils to dry up it's just the same like this one when you wash you put them here and it drains the water here and after it completes you wipe it and it becomes so so clean yeah so the plates are well arranged it has some things here you know all the spoons they are on one place cutlery items they are on one place and the cooking items they are on one place yeah so that's the full 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 tour on this side i really hope you enjoyed but for me i've loved here and what i can say i'll miss this place so, so much when i go back to nyabuhanse you know right now i'm used to these using these things here so when i go back i think i'll miss them yeah but soon again we'll get to visit yeah so i think maybe i think maybe i'll be traveling tonight you know yeah you know kemi has missed me so much at least i can go and give her some nice company for me i really enjoyed my stay here and uh, i've got to learn new things I've got to learn also some cooking ideas from my friend Stacy because I realized she knows how to prepare her food so nicely with lots of ingredients. Is it called ingredients or spices? Yeah, she cooks her food so so nicely. Yeah, so I think also when we get there to Nyabuhase, we'll get also to try her new cooking methods. Yeah, it's like I've learned something new. Yeah yeah so i hope you also enjoyed the ground floor tour you know the view of the cars how they are well parked it's so clean like here yeah, everything is so, i've never seen a clean place like this one yeah but there's a place also i've seen there where i visited at kakuma de in trukana i also realized the people there in that village they usually sweep their compound you can't find it like with uh, some pieces of paper no like you just find it so so clean you know like people in the community they like only one person decides today yeah let me sweep and uh, he keeps the environment so clean so i also realized they are at their place they are so so clean well thank you so much for watching this video till this point and right now i'm just relaxing here on the outside I'm enjoying the last last moments, you know, when I go back to Nyabuhanse, I'll never get to find something nice like this. Yeah, so just enjoying my last moments here and I hope again to visit here next time. Yeah, so when I guess she'll invite me back, I'll get to visit her again. I told her also she's uh, welcome there at Nyabuhanse. Whenever she wants to visit there, we can host her with my sister Kemi here. Yeah, so I told her she should also visit there Nyabuhanse. Nyabuhanse is also a nice place and um, it's full of grids. It's a nice village. And also anybody watching this, if you want to visit us there at Nyabuhanse, you are welcome so so much anytime yeah so for me i'll be also be traveling very soon and um what i can say i just meet i'll just miss the climate over here but uh too sad i also didn't get a chance to explore the swimming pool actually i've been yearning for it so badly yeah but um for me, I could even just have entered, even if it's cold, just to you know to explore it and enjoy the the cool waters, you know, swimming. Yeah, but uh, maybe there's next time. Yeah, or maybe we'll find one day in Nyabuhanse. No Nyabuhanse, there's no swimming pool, unless if you visit Migori or maybe Sirare, you'll find one. Yeah, so maybe if you find there also one, we'll get to explore it. Yeah, but I really wanted it so badly because this one you don't pay. It's free because it's inside the compound. Yeah, but when we'll go there at Sirare or Baby Bigori, you have to pay for it so that you can enter inside. So that's the difference. But um, 
if we get that chance we'll get again to explore for me i've been really really yearning to know how to swim you know it has been a dream let's say man maybe but god forbid let's say maybe you went somewhere and something bad happened you know at least uh, when you know how to swim you can at least save yourself but uh, when you don't know oh it's too bad yeah so for me i really want to know how to swim and uh, also get to explore like uh, you know the new things here for me i've enjoyed here the big city and um till next time you know maybe this is the last video which i'm taking here for this place enjoy the last moments here but maybe if we get a chance again we'll get to visit you know i used to come here at night and uh, you know just see how beautiful the lights they are during the night you see the place is kind of dark but they are i don't know if they are called street lights but uh, they come in a in a um, summer cream color so it makes the place even look like a, a palace you know that's the beauty of this place so what i can say i'll miss it i'll miss this road but there's next time here yeah, so for me i've enjoyed the stay here and i wish to appreciate my friends so so much for hosting me and also for helping me to explore you know the new things over here i've got to cook in a modern kitchen which i have never i've never experienced yeah at least right now i know how to put it on to put off the fire at least i have an idea yeah but with time we'll also be exploring some new things yeah so this is all i had for today and you can drop some sweet comments according to how you see this place for me it's just a 10 out of 10 yeah i hope you enjoyed the full tour and also this one here it's used for storing water like on the upper part i was told that's a tank so i don't know if there are some tanks inside i'm not sure if, if, if it's the black tank yeah but i don't know how these people manage to climb you know from the downer part until to the upper part to put the tank from the top you know th those are skilled workers for me i know it's not that easy because one slight mistake if you fall you're going to break your legs yeah so i think the people are so experienced i've never seen also something like this it's the first one yeah so till tomorrow and thank you so much for watching this video till this point may god bless you so so much thank you so much for always supporting us We'll be soon back in the village to continue with our normal cooking. Yeah, bye bye from this side. If you haven't subscribed to Baby Caro, kindly do so. Till tomorrow. Ciao, ciao. Hasta la vista. And namaste. Thank you. Yeah, namaste. Is, I think it's thank you. Bye.